Hugos are back in this biatch. And that's a surprise because Posh usually never finds anything. No, he's usually always, yeah. he's always usually behind the camera, like always. Usually. But, uh... And they're at five. Yeah, that's right. Today, guys, we actually went, well, it wasn't today, it was a few days ago, but nonetheless, we went yard selling, and um, we found some stuff, finally. Yeah, we did. Now, oh, we found some things. We, we found some stuff. Now, I, we, we should also mention as well that um, there wasn't a lot of footage. No. Uh, and, 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 Can and, we tell them why? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Well... Joey's son went with us. Yeah, we had Caden this weekend. Yeah, and, and uh, last night. Last, uh, well, this morning. This morning. Well, the, the morning we went yard sale. Yeah, the morning we went yard sale. He ended up throwing up. He ended up throwing uh, he up. He didn't feel good. He didn't feel no, good. I'll be honest, I didn't feel good either. No. Uh, and, and we found out why. Yeah, we found out why. Um, something's wrong with Burger King. <laughs> anyway. Uh, he got sick from Burger King. Yeah. And uh, we only went to, how many, we only hit maybe four or five sales. Yeah. We didn't have a lot of sales, but um, there were a lot of sales, though. Yeah. But we only hit, I don't know, actually, we probably hit five or six. Yeah. Because there were a couple that we didn't find anything. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, and my son wasn't feeling well. I mean, I, I bought him some, some uh, Pepto-Bismol tablets, and he started to feel a little yeah, bit Yeah, he better. started to feel better. So, uh, so we, we uh, I think it was after the second sale or so, uh, I, I, uh, he started feeling better. Yeah, he started feeling better. So, so we hit another three or four sales before we quit. Uh, and, uh, we actually found some stuff. And unfortunately, I couldn't get a lot of footage because I had my son with me. And he was sick. And he wasn't feeling well. So I apologize that there wasn't a lot of footage this time. I really do. But, uh, you know, we can only do what we can do. But, as a fucking train's coming, it always comes through when we're fucking filming. Yeah, anyway. yes, always. Uh, anyway. Woo! Woo! Ice train, bitch! <laughs> ice train, well, bitch. Well, you know. I hear the train coming. It's uh, rolling around the bend. Oh, it's rolling around the bend, all right. Uh, but also, uh, every, kind of every fucking time. So I, I want to apologize for that. But and we we'll apologize to train every time it comes around when we film this. <laughs> it is. Uh, we live. We live real close to the track. Yeah. Uh, now, once again, we only hit about maybe five or six sales. There were a couple that we didn't find anything, but there was some stuff that we did find at yeah. another sale. And um, the fir the very first sale, the we very hit, first yard sale we hit. Tommy finds a couple things. Yep, you found a lot. And I found a lot of things. Um, do you want to show your first? Yeah, I'll show the first thing. Off. Okay. I picked this. Uh, what is it? A canvas? It's a it's a it's a canvas painting. Yeah, it's a canvas painting. I only paid five dollars for it. Five dollars. That's my price range. Ain't that right, Charles? <laughs> that's, that's a Tommy deal. That's that's a Tommy deal, with Charles and Jen. Ain't that right? Not the total. Deal. No, not the total. That's a Tommy deal. Ain't that right, Charles and Jennifer? That's right. I picked up, this is a, an NFL paint canvas. Yeah. Uh, it's from 2003. Look, Charles, they got your Detroit Lions right yeah, there. Yeah, the Detroit Lions are on there. Uh, uh, I know the Jags are on there somewhere. There's the Jags. Oh, yeah, there's Tony Khan. Uh, and this even has the Redskins on yeah. it. So, the, uh, uh, the Chicago the, Bears are on there. The, 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 original, the, the original helmet uh, uh, the design. Logo. Yeah, yeah. logo. And this is from uh, uh, this is from 2013. It is a uh, painting for the uh, uh, it's a canvas painting. These uh, these honestly these they used to sell these at Walmart, and I think they do sell certain ones yeah. at Walmart. Uh, you can even try to find these online, like on eBay. These are worth like 20 bucks if you yeah. find them. Uh, Tommy wanted to get it because he's a big fan of football. Yeah, and it was only five dollars. It was only five bucks. So. Tommy decided to get uh, this uh, this painting here. Yeah. Uh, I'll go ahead and get it out of the shot. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah shot. It's really big. But, yeah, he only paid $5 only for it. Only paid 5 bucks. And, uh, yeah. It was, I thought it looked pretty cool. Yeah, so. it, looked, it looked pretty cool. It does. It looks it looks good. So I was like, so, fuck Tommy's it. Tommy's going to hang that in his room? Yeah, I'm going to hang that in my room there. But uh, you also, uh, well, I, I seen that. Yeah, and you passed on it. And I passed on it. And you're like, when you, when you found out the price, you're like, I wish I didn't pass. I wish I would have grabbed it. <laughs> I would have I would have just traded in. But, well, yeah, but, but, but yeah, I know you would have grabbed it if I didn't take it. Well, I, I, I asked I, I asked Tom, I was like, hey, do you want this? Because this is the only, this was the only game they had. Only game. And I was like, okay. 
<coughs> what they have, Tommy? Their only game. Well, for one dollar. One dollar. EA Sports Charles Reed Fowler collection right here. The Charles selection. The Charles selection. For the PlayStation 2. For the PlayStation 2, EA Sports MVP Baseball 2005. 2005. From the Charles selection. And it's only one dollar. One dollar. I would have paid a dollar for it. And it is complete. complete. Wow, it's it. And, and, and the disc is flawless. Yeah, the disc, the disc is like it's never been played. It it's is like a, brand spanking Yeah, it new. looks brand new. I'm, I'm not kidding. It it's, looks brand it's got, new. It's got some fingerprints, but yeah. but it's like brand fucking spanking new. So it's like, you know what? For, for one dollar, I'll take that deal. Uh, for the game stuff, we went on price charting. And uh, MVP Baseball 2005 complete according to price charting eight bucks. I didn't I didn't know it was that much. Yeah, it was only eight dollars, and I only paid a dollar for it. You'll keep it. Yeah, I'm keeping it. Yeah, I don't have it, so I'm adding to my collection. Well, you, you, uh, you do play baseball. Oh yeah, I like baseball games. Then I went through and I looked. There, there wasn't too much on the on the uh, on the um, uh, on the tables that they had. No, that the best two things were the ones I grabbed. Yeah, were. Things Tommy grabs, and and, and and I was looking, <clears throat> and then I noticed I noticed that there was a box sitting there. Yeah, and I started looking. And I, and I looked over there, and when you looked over there, I was like, and then I noticed that there was some wrestlers. Yeah, in this box, and the, the box said, uh, "All figures," because there was also some other figures in yeah. there too, but like some course, miscellaneous. Yeah, figures. some miscellaneous figures. Nothing great, but. But I did see the wrestlers there, and that said, caught his eye. Yeah, that caught my eye because uh, you know I, we love wrestling, uh, and they were fifty cents a piece. Yeah, and I was like fifty cents. Hmm. And then not only that, I should mention this: that my son grabbed this. Yeah. And this was two dollars, and I have it sitting here because it's it's really it's fucking big. huge, just like the thing yeah, I have. Yeah, it's fucking huge. My son seen this because it was sitting in the box. It was on the outer side of the box, right? It was inside the box, but it was against the box. And then all the figures and stuff yeah. were inside. It, my son wanted to get this, so I got it for him. It is a steel cage. A steel cage. Uh, I put it together. All the pieces are here. At first, we didn't know if all yeah, the pieces yeah, were Yeah, I, I wasn't sure. And that, then we weren't going to get it. Yeah, I, I, I was thinking about passing on it because I was like, you know what? I'm not sure if all the pieces uh, and he are really there. Wanted. And my son's like, but dad, I want it. I was like, all right, because he, he wasn't feeling well. I was like, all right, I'll get it for him, you know, because because he has a few wrestling rings. And this fits all wrestling rings, yeah. by the way, all the all the WWE uh, uh, rings. This cage, believe it or not, it actually is complete. It's all here. It even has a door on it, so you can put and your fingers the door opens. Yeah, the door opens. And you can even blast through wrestlers through the uh, through the, through the thing, so you can kind of you know make yeah. them fall through the uh, the cage on the side. Uh, this is actually from 2013. This is uh, a steel cage from 2013, Mattel. And believe it or not, my son scored on this because uh, uh, I uh, I asked the lady how much the cage was, and she said the cage is two dollars. It's like okay. Come to find out, guys, this WWE steel cage from uh, uh, from Mattel of 2013, if it's complete, which this is, it, it it's all put together. All you gotta do is slide it on a, on a ring uh, with the little post things that they got here. Twenty five dollars, according twenty five bucks, according to eBay, is how much this cage is worth. I was like, that's a fucking deal right there. So I got I got that cage for my son because he loves. And, and by the way. Yeah. By the way, he he played, he played with them all his own. Yeah, there it is. Uh, <laughs> uh, but uh, what I found was I actually found some wrestlers. Yeah. And, and they were fifty cents a piece. And fifty I was like, cents a piece. I was hoping for some Hasbro's, but you know it is what it is. But but, but these are just as good. But these are just as good because uh, this this is stuff I grew up playing except for one of them because you know it's this. Yeah. One. The other ones I grew up playing with or or you know kind of you know around that time. Let's go and show you guys what I what I end up getting. There's this, which is this is from Toy Biz WCW. Now I will say this: some of these are not in the best condition, of course. But they, some, are, but they were fifty cents. But they were fifty cents. Uh, some of them are a little roughed up. The WCW ones are a little rough. The WWF ones are actually in decent condition. 
but uh, this one is from Toy Biz. It's supposed to be Rey Mysterio, but it's not a real figure. It came with, like, like it came in one of the Goldberg. Yeah. Uh, the one with Goldberg, where you can, like, spear him through whatever, because his body kind of flops over and stuff. Uh, this is only worth, like, three bucks on eBay, but still, I got it for 50 cents. Then we have... Tommy, one of your favorites. Oh, yeah. The Lethal Weapon, Steve Blackman. Yep. Or as the old lady said... Black man. Black man! <laughs> you suck, black man! Uh, this is actually... Bring it on, black man! Yeah, bring, it on. Yeah, bring it on, black man, bring it on. You know, you know with Al Snow? Yeah. Uh, this is actually... Only really, good thing Al Snow did. <laughs> this is actually in decent condition. This is a Steve Blackman from 1998. This is a Jax... Uh, 1998 figure of Steve Blackman, and it's worth like six bucks, but I only paid 50 cents. Then, um, another Toy Biz from WCW, you know, a little, a little, not in the best condition, but it is there. It is a DDP. Yeah. Diamond DDP. Dallas Page, and, and he does the, oh, well, goddamn, his leg was kicked. <laughs> but anyway, he's, yeah, he's, he's supposed to sign for the diamond cutter. Yeah. But, uh, a little leg problem. Well, there. well, you 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 don't want to grab him by the by the by the legs down here. You want to grab him by like his his knees because it yeah. makes it better. Yeah. But um, it, you know, worth like five bucks, but fifty cents. This I got because, well, I'm a Paul Virtual fan. Uh -huh. Some people aren't because uh, they grew up. Um, oh, and by the way, this is a 1999. Toy Biz um, uh, DDP. How much is it? Uh, five bucks. Five bucks. This is uh, from 2003. It says 2003. But I know he didn't have this gimmick till like 2006, 2007. Yeah. But this is also a Jack specific uh, WWE action figure of Paul Burchill. Uh, I liked Paul Burchill before he was the pirate. And uh, th th it was kind of odd seeing that there because I was like, who bought a Paul yeah. Burchill action figure? Because you don't see... You, no, uh, no. A lot of people don't really buy the Paul Burchill action figure. But um, me and Tommy watched him a lot in OVW when, yeah. he, when he was the Ripper Paul Burchill. He was OVW champion for quite a bit, and we enjoyed him as, as the Ripper Paul Burchill. So I picked this up. You know, it's only worth like five bucks, but still. Then we got a really beat up... This is probably the one that's beat up the most. It's a uh, Lex Luger. A 1999 Lex Luger from Toy Biz. Not in the best condition, but he still does his action. He, he does the torture rack if you if you kind of put put his uh, see. Yeah. He does the torture rack. Uh, Lex Luger in this condition um, is worth around seven dollars. Then we got. Uh, oh, Charles is up. Yeah, thing. Charles is boy himself. Buff Bagwell Buff is he the, ain't stuff. the stuff. Buzz, Buff is the stuff. I, 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 always, I always called it only he wasn't the stuff. And then he has this little lever on the back, and he does this. <laughs> I'm not sure if he's setting up for the blockbuster or what. But uh, none of the best condition. His hair is kind of peeling off. But uh, nonetheless, I only got it for 50 cents. Uh, believe it or not, eight bucks. Toy Biz. Uh, Buff Bagwell. Then the ones that the 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 two that are worth uh, somewhat the the most is we have a 2013 Randy Orton uh, when he had his head shaved, not shaved bald, but when he had yeah. it really really cut low. And this is a 2013 Mattel. Sorry, not 2013. 2010. Excuse me. 2010. Mattel, Randy Orton, worth eight bucks. I didn't know that. And then the one that I definitely wanted to pick up yeah. seen it was this one. And this is the one that's worth the most, guys, if you guys ever find it out in the wild. This is a... If I can get him to stand up correctly. This is a 1996 Jax Pacific Ultimate Warrior. And uh, it's actually in really good condition. This yeah, is, it is. This is actually the one that's in the best condition as far as, like, there's not, like, any scratches or anything on him or any, like, uh, 
like marks like you see in Orton's legs there. You don't see it on on uh, on uh, 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 you know uh, the Ultimate Warrior figure, and he even has the tassels. Yeah. Uh, the only thing is because you know it's, his legs want to bend and his arms want to bend and everything, but you know th that's the way these figures were made. But uh, believe it or not, if you find this figure in like perfect condition, it could be worth up to like twenty five bucks. I'm going to put a condition of like fifteen on this. Considering it's not, in, you know, it's in it's in pretty good condition, but it's not in the best condition. Fifteen dollar, uh, go on eBay. You'll look it up. Just type in nineteen ninety six uh, Jacks Ultimate Warrior. Yeah, oh, yeah, right there, sleepy. No, <laughs> I, I I would just look. Uh, is, is that right there the real tassels? The order yeah, order yeah. Order? Just... It's like it's like yeah, the, yeah, 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 yeah. It is like the real tassel. Yeah, that's yeah. what I was looking at. I, I thought, I, I thought it might be like rubber or something like that. No, the, the the tassels are like like made out of yarn. So now now the ones on his arm are just like painted yeah. on, but he actually has the tassels that kind of come out and they're actually like made out of like yarn. So that's a pretty cool find. Uh, and that's and that's that's all we found at that at that uh, at that yeah. first sale. But uh, like we, it was I was cool like, to find all that it stuff. was cool. I found a bunch of old school fucking action figures. And they were really cheap. Found a twenty-five dollar fucking cage. Yeah. Tommy found a, a great painting that he wanted and a PS2 game. Uh, I was I was like hell yeah, we're, we're fucking getting on there. Right? I didn't find jack shit there. I didn't find anything until we went to. Uh, then we went to a. Uh, <clears throat> we went to a church sale. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Usually we never find anything in the church. Like, yeah, we, uh, uh, like, like yeah. uh, that was the second sale we went to was the church sale. We're like, yeah, we're go we're gonna look and see if we find anything, right? And you know it's true, Joey. Usually we never find anything in the church sale. Church sales for us have been kind of busts, and that, you know, once again, that's just us. That 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 doesn't include everybody. I mean, yeah. some people. I think I've only found like one really good thing at a church sale, but we went there, and. Tried to search around, didn't really find much until we came across some boxes. Boxes. Yeah. And these boxes had DVDs. And Tommy, what were the prices on these DVDs? 25 cents each. 25 cents each. A quarter. A quarter. A quarter. I'm like, oh, fuck, let's see if we find any good DVDs in there. Let's see if we find any good DVDs in there. Uh... So we started searching around. Uh, Tommy, you want to you want to show a couple that you got yeah. there? Yeah. First one, I found double feature. <clears throat> double feature. Double feature. Stuart Little and Stuart Little too. You decided, hey, for a quarter. For a quarter, I was like, fuck it. They did have both of these on regular DVD. Yeah. I was like, I just saw the double feature. I was like, I might as well get this. Yeah. Then to get them single. Yeah. yeah then get them single. It, it's there. They're, yeah. they're both there. See? They're on the yep. same disc. You paid a quarter. I paid 25 cents. On eBay, it's worth like $4. Yeah. That's, that's, so, that, that's 25 cents. 25 cents? Which one would rather pay $4 online or yeah. a quarter? Uh, yeah, at, I was at, like, at, at, I saw at, at like, they had the just Stuart Little and Stuart Little 2 in singles. Yeah. But I was like, you might as well, I might as well just get the double feature. I don't think I've seen the second one. I've seen the second. I've seen the first one. I've seen the first one. I've never seen the second one. So the second one's a little bit new to me. I've never seen this one. But worth like $4 on eBay yeah. time, I only paid 25 cents. That's 25 cents for it. Show us some more there. You got All right. You found this one. Yeah, I found this. Disney's and Pixar yeah. DVD. DVD. Finding Nemo. Twenty-five cents. This time I've been trying to collect some of the Disney DVDs, and uh, I told Tommy, I was like, Tommy, yeah. Tommy, you're not going to be twenty-five cents. Yeah, yeah, I was like, you know what? And it's a good shape. If you want it, you might as well pick it up. You're not going to be twenty-five cents a DVD. I'm sorry, you won't. So I was like, you know what? Finding Nemo, fuck it, I'll buy it. It's twenty-five cents. Yeah. Worth like four dollars, but yeah. still twenty-five cents. Twenty-five cents. So I was like, I'll take that. Like he. Like, like, even if you went to go sell these on eBay, you'd make some money at twenty five yeah. cents. Yeah. So I was like, you know what? I'll, I'll, I'll take it for twenty five cents. Yeah. And I found another one: Disney Pixar Finding Doria. Dory. Dory. Sorry. Yeah. 
the one because uh, uh, it was Finding Nemo four first, and then that one came out uh, yeah. like I don't know, like six or seven years later. Yeah. Yeah. So Finding Dory. Finding Dory, and that one is worth five dollars. You only pay fifty cents. Not twenty five. Oh yeah, twenty-five cents. Twenty-five dollars okay. for that. Twenty-five cents, not twenty-five dollars. Twenty-five cents. Yeah, I'm not so very dead. Twenty-five cents. Yeah, you're too busy wanting to sleep. <laughs> sleep or play Red Dead, right? Yeah. Either one. Either one. So five indoors. Twenty-five cents. Twenty-five cents. Uh, worth five bucks. And what was the last one you picked up? And I found another one there. Yeah. This one. You paid a dollar's worth. Yeah, I paid a dollar worth. Yeah. Wesley Snipes. And Woody Harrison. Yeah, Woody Harrison and White Men Can't Jump. That's Great. a good movie. Yeah. This is a really good movie. Great movie. And I was like, for 25 cents, and it's a good movie, I'll buy it. Yeah. And it is complete. Complete? Yep. And on eBay sold, five bucks. Five bucks, and I only paid 25 cents. 25 cents. So I was like, you know what, I'll take that. And then Pops, you found three DVDs that uh, you wanted. Yeah, I, I found uh, three DVDs that, that, that I want. I'm going to put this right here, like this right here. Okay, go ahead. Uh, the first one is, I, you know, I, I, I always like Stephen King, so, you know, it's, it's yeah. cool, it, you know. Uh, I got Thinner. Thinner. It's a, it's a good movie, I, 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 you know, and everything like that right here. I, I, I watched it on, on, you know, on TV. And uh, it's always up nice, you know, if you like, it, like a movie, you know, it's always nice to get one, you know, on DVD, which I most usually have anyway. And, and you know, it's... It, uh, it's complete. Yeah, with a little insert and everything. Yeah, yeah, and it's it's clean. I will, you know, get down in there with it. You can get it. I can get it. There we go. It's clean. Yeah. yeah. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, worth five dollars on eBay. But uh, you only paid how much, Pop? Twenty-five cents. Twenty-five cents. Better. And then. I, I, like I said, I, I, I've, I've seen the, the movies, you know, and, and everything like right there. But I, I never, I never, you know, had, had the, the thinner or this next one coming up, Demolition Man. Sylvester Stallone and Wesley Sylvester, Snipes. The Demolition Man. Demolition Man. And you know, well, the, the case is kind of all messed up. Yeah, the, right here. the case but, is cracked. Yeah, the case but, is cracked everywhere. But, but it's twenty-five cents. But yeah. you know, you can. You know, it still you, opens you, and yeah, and, it still the, opens up. You know, and the disc is in a really good you get condition. Get there with it. It still opens up. There we go. What it is, it's just a plastic thing is what it is. Yeah, the plastic's broken. And it's really good condition. Complete. And it's complete. Yep. And the, the disc is not in bad shape. You know. And again, and again, how much did you pay for it? Twenty-five cents. Twenty-five cents. Worth five bucks. Yeah. Now. Now I found this one for you. Yeah, Tommy found this for. Because, because I, I don't know, you know, I don't know if any of you know, you know, about the, the heat of the night. You, I, I'm pretty sure y'all know about the series with, with, with Carol O'Connor. But this right here is the first one, the first movie. heat of the night movie that come out. Before the series. Before the series come out. Here we go. Sydney Poitier. Sydney Poitier. And you've been wanting that DVD. Yeah, I, I, I've been wanting that right there. Pops has been looking for this DVD for a yeah, while. Yeah, I've been looking for it for a while. And, 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 and who was to know? Who was to know that it would be in a church? For 25 cents. Yeah. Who would know that? I tell you, it, and I found it for you. Yeah, Tommy did. And look at that. It's, it's complete. 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 Great, condi great condition, too. Great condition. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Great condition. Also a five dollar DVD, but still twenty five like, cents. Like even at five dollars, still pops pops still couldn't find that anywhere. No, like, I, yeah, I, I could we, not we we find it anywhere. You know, and 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 to me, you know, if you really want to know, you, you treat this this right here all started the series. No doubt. Yeah. Uh, Foul now on the prop. Yeah, foul. Oh, I love that. Tommy, Tommy just digs that right here. I, 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 you know, let's have the pie. Let's have the pie. <laughs> I, I know when I watch this right here, and when he gets the part Tommy likes, we might never watch again. We might never watch again. We might never watch that goddamn chef act like a fool. Have <laughs> <Hide> the pie. <laughs> and he has that nasty pie. Uh, <laughs> so that, that that is what I picked up, and I'm very 20, glad to have. For 25 cents, I'm sorry, you can't pass DVDs up for 25, 25. Or, or even 50 cents. But uh, I'm going to show you guys what I got next.
And then I found a DVD. Yeah, and, even you found some at the church yeah, sale. Yeah, at the church sale. Um, I found a DVD and I found a game. Yeah. They only had one game. There. One game. I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and take it. And, and it was decently priced. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. The case is the cases uh, seen better days. I do have a replacement case, so though. it's no big deal. So it's not a big, it's not a big deal. For the PlayStation Three, this is the game, of the, the game of the year edition, the Walking Dead, the Tell Tell game series. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of of, of uh, the Walking Dead. Actually, I've never really watched it, mainly because I don't really care about zombies. It's just not my thing. But I do like playing games. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that that do involve zombies. I don't care. I don't. I, I'm. I'm just not a big movie guy. It's just not my thing. But uh, it does. It it is complete. Uh, in really good condition, actually. Besides the 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 ripped front of the case, which is no big deal. I got I got replacement PS3 cases. I can replace it. No 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 biggie. Uh, the artwork isn't too messed up, so. Yeah. It's not a big deal. And uh, according to price charting, this game is nine bucks complete. But wow. but I only paid three dollars. Three bucks. Three dollars. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna pick that up. Why not? Especially for three bucks. Yeah. It's really cheap. Yeah. And you even found a DVD. And then I found a DVD. Now this DVD spoke to me because I remember seeing it in a lot of other hunting videos for that matter. And I knew this DVD was worth a little something. Um, you know, uh, I do watch some gaming people that do a lot of game hunts. I know, uh, Gaming Off the Grid, uh, Retro Rick. Retro Rick, baby. Uh, they do a lot of I like Retro hunts. Rick. Yeah. Uh, yeah he, 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 he watches yeah. them all the time. I do watch them quite a bit, and I do notice that sometimes they picked up this DVD, and I, I actually watched this DVD with my ex-wife when we were together. I didn't care for it. But that's just me because I'm not I'm not a big uh, I'm not big into uh, horror that much. Um, well, you do have horror movies. I do have a few horror movies. But it's but the ones you like. It's the ones I was like. It's the ones I like, and I've watched this before. I wasn't that impressed with it, but I mean, some people can be. And this, I seen, and I was like, is, is that the DVD? And I was like, yes, it is. Well, you want to tell you what's making me like? Oh, the the name. Yeah, on the front. yeah. What the. <laughs> Joe Anderson. Oh, Joe. <laughs> Joe Anderson, I got your DVD, pal. Uh, I'm not sure if it's a girl or if it's a guy, but Joe Anderson, because it's J-O and then it's Anderson. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's a girl or a guy. But, but you got the DVD. It's yours now. But it's mine now. Uh, well, it won't be mine now. Cause I'm, I'm, uh, this, yeah, you're selling that. This is a flip. This isn't for me to, for my collection or nothing. But if you, got, if you guys find this DVD out in the wild, if you guys find this for a dollar, if you guys find this for cheap, Pick it up because it's a good film. Well, flip. you found it for 25 cents. I found it for 25 cents. And it's Stephen King's Rose Red. This DVD is, once again, it's not worth a ton, but it's a nice flip DVD. If you could flip a DVD for 15, 20 bucks, uh, if you want to flip it on eBay, if you want to flip it locally or whatever, it's a decent little flip if you want to set like Macari or yeah. whatever. If you want to flip it for a, like really cheap, uh, or, or flip it for uh, for a, you know, hey, would you rather have uh, twenty you know fifteen twenty dollars in your wallet yeah. or something that you really don't care yeah. about? Now, I got the money in my wallet, no doubt. And uh, I actually <laughs> bought this just to kind of recoup the cost of the stuff I spent yard selling, and it does. Uh, and uh, I'm not sure if it comes with a insert or not, but it's not there. But both yeah. discs, both discs are there, and they're in good shape. And they're in good shape. And I got this for 25 cents. 25 cents. And uh, I put on here uh, that this is worth around 18 dollars, roughly. Because um, some some could be 15, some could be 20. Yeah. Uh, I just I just kind of met in the middle around eighteen bucks. So if you find Rose Red out in the wild, pick it up. I got it for twenty five cents, and I'm going to flip it and kind of recoup the cost of everything I bought because I really don't care about this DVD, but I do know that. It, and uh, Joe Anderson, thank I have. You. I yeah, thank you for for turning into that church sale, and I'm going to be flipping it to somebody else. So thank you, Joe. Thank you, Joe. 
then Tommy, me and you went to um, we went to another yard yeah. sale. Uh, didn't really find much at this yard sale. No. This was like an impromptu stop. Yeah. Because we stopped by we stopped by a convenience store, right? Yeah. Because my son had to uh, use the restroom. Yeah, use the restroom because he because he wasn't feeling well. And and, I, uh, and we both and me and him and grabbed a little breakfast. Yeah, grabbed a, grabbed a couple of uh, breakfast, uh, you know, sandwiches. And uh, so we we seen that across the street at this uh, the yard sale at this uh, apartment complex. Yeah, apartment complex. The there, yard sale. There was another yard sale. And um, went over there, and uh, we picked up a few things. I'll go ahead and show you what I got. Um, it is Arnold Schwarzenegger's Predator. Yeah. And this is a this is the special collector's edition for the 15th anniversary. On the front, there's uh, there's Arnold, and on the back is Predator. But there, it's kind of dark. You probably yeah, yeah, you guys probably can't see it that well. But uh, it is a uh, it's a two disc set, and uh, there's Jesse. Yeah, there's Jesse, Jesse the Body Ventura, and Carl Withers, right there, and th and that's one of the other reasons why I bought the DVD Jesse too. Jesse Ventura. I, I love Jesse the Body, and uh, it does have a little booklet here, so that's cool. And there's Jesse again, right yeah, there. There's Jesse, baby, and. Um, Decided to pick this up. It has a lot of bonus scenes and deleted scenes and things of that nature. And you um, don't have it. I don't have it. I actually don't have Predator at all. Actually, I was going to... I asked Pops if he had Predator. And, and of course, the old man has Predator. Yep. Uh, so, I decided, you know, I'm going to pick it up for myself. And um, this this is worth like six bucks. And the lady at the apartment complex had all, all of her DVDs for a dollar. She, she, she would have gave us a deal if she picked yeah. up a lot more. But she said if we bought five, we got one free. But unfortunately, there wasn't a lot of good deals yeah. there, so I did, we didn't really find. Too we kind of picked out the good ones. Yeah. Well, for us. Yeah, for us. Yeah. And they kind of all center around wrestling. Yeah, they do. Because the Predator has Jesse the Body yep. in it, and my two has wrestlers. And Tommy's has wrestlers in it. Uh, but this, yeah, this is worth like six bucks if you find this collector's edition. So that's what I picked up for myself. What'd you, what'd you get? Well, I picked The Rock Walking Tall. The Rock Walking Tall. One dollar. One dollar. And I've seen this movie before. It's a pretty decent movie. It's decent, yeah. There's no insert, but the disc is in pretty decent shape. Yeah. So, it's like, you know what? I'll take it for a dollar. Rock solid action. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rock solid action. Uh, I was like, you know what? I'll, I'll buy it. It's a dollar. Uh, it's worth like four bucks, but but uh, it, it's it's a DVD that Tommy wanted to yeah, get. Yeah, I was like, you know what? Fuck, it's a dollar. It's a dollar. Who cares? Who cares? Really cheap. Now, now you know I found this one. Tommy, we found that at Peddler's Mall. How much did I want for it? Oh, this one? Yeah. At Peddler's Mall, yeah, they wanted two bucks. Was it two or three? It was. It, it, it was about two or three bucks. Yeah, it, it was one to two. And I told Tommy, I was like, Tom, because Tom, I, I was going to buy it, but yeah, I was like, oh man, I'm gonna wait. Yeah, I told Tommy, I was like, Tommy, you might as well wait. We might find that DVD out in the wild somewhere for cheap. And lo and behold, we yeah. did. I got the uh, the Marine Two. Yeah. With Ted DiBiase Jr. Yeah, at, at Peddler's Mall. At Peddler's Mall, which was a dollar. Yeah, which was a dollar. A dollar two dollars. Uh, two dollars. because that was brand new. Yeah, that was brand new. I picked up John Cena, the Marine. Un unrated. Uh, unrated. Not X-rated. <laughs> unrated. <laughs> unrated. I was like, okay, fuck it. It's here. It's a dollar. I ain't gonna get it any cheaper. Yeah. And so I was like, you know what? I'll buy it. And uh, it it's worth four bucks on eBay. Yeah. It, so I was like, you know what? I'll take it. You know, you know how many times I tried to watch that movie and I, and I just couldn't get through it. <laughs> I watched. Like I fell times. asleep on it too, but I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I don't have it, and I'm starting trying to collect the WWE Studios for cheap. Yeah. I was trying to get it for cheap. Or the wrestler DVDs. And wrestling DVDs that have wrestlers in the movie. Yeah. Anything that involves wrestlers in a movie, I'll buy. Yeah. So I was like, so I was like, for a dollar, I'll take it. No doubt. 
then our last stop, well, sorry, Pops has one more stop. Oh, there. yeah. Now, no. I'll say this, that, Pops didn't even get out of the car for this one. No, he, he didn't car. get out of the car. He was there with Kate. That, yeah, he goes, he goes, he goes, I'm just going to sit back with Kate and you guys go yeah. go in there and look. Uh, well, well Kate didn't feel good. Uh, Kate still didn't feel 100% at the time. So I decided, well, look, I'm just going to stay here. Because to me, it just, <clears throat> to be totally honest, it looked like it was just, uh, you know, glassware. It was and not a like big yard sale. It was, no. it was a small yard sale, and it looked like me, like all the different selling clothes and, and whatnots and stuff like that, okay? So that's why I didn't get out. <clears throat> but, <clears throat> Joey got, uh, Joey uh, got this right here for me because, uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a big fan of, of this guy, and everybody that's watched our videos knows that I am. He got me some uh, Elvis Presley uh, uh, postcards. Postcards that that people had. Yep. Uh, this yard sale had had them in yeah. a bag, and uh, I decided to pick them up for the old man. Now these are 1977 yeah. postcards from Graceland. Now I. I now listen right here. Nope. Sorry. Now listen right here. It, it, I, you know he, he had a lot of, of, of outfits, but this right here is my favorite right here. I, 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 I seen. I, I didn't see him in person, but I seen him on TV performing that right there outfit, which is which is a great outfit. I yeah, mean, and, I and and on the back you can tell it's a postcard. Yeah. But. Uh, and uh, this. This right here. That's that's one of these cars. You know. Pops loves Elvis. Yeah, I love him. Uh, here we go. Elvis uh, live live on. Is it, is that what it says? Yeah. Yep. The yeah. king lives on. Yeah. The king lives on. Now, now this, now this right here, <clears throat> they did a little thing uh, in his house, and and this right here is from a from a person uh, that that Elvis knew that painted this right here picture of him. So this right here was actually done by, by a real person. All that said, this right here, they took a picture of it, postcard picture of it. But but it hangs in Elvis's house. It's real. This, yeah, it's it's real. Yeah. It actually he, they, this guy actually painted it. Right there's what it looks like. Yeah. You know that that that, that is look that, that that is fucking brilliant work. And here we have, <clears throat> as everybody knows, you know the the Graceland, you know, the, the, there there's the gate. The, the, with the music notes on it uh, and everything that there's a back of uh, the front, front, front side of Graceland and this right here is get right there you know. that's that's the house that's the house right there then. Yeah. that's Graceland right there that's the front of the house yeah I mean, I mean you, you, you know, you look at that right there, and you feel in, you know, coming coming out of, out, out of the house or going back into it. Yeah. Now this right here, kind of like a booklet. Yeah. It's, it's right here, kind of like a book booklet. It starts with this right here. Then, then you just go shows on. Shows you some Graceland. It, shows shows yeah. you a lot of photos of all you, this. Just, you just go on and on with it. Yeah. Yeah, right there. Then you, then you can turn it over. See it right there. Yeah. And uh, they have this sitting there in that little bag. Uh, but I am, or, like I said, I I, I am a, a big fan of Elvis, so you know. You decide, I, I, yeah. I, I, I I I I decided to, to to just go ahead and buy it for the old man because because I know he'd buy yeah. it. Yeah. I, I would have bought it. it. I would have. Oh, look at this right here. You know, this 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 one right here. It, it, this right here outfit was. I don't know if you guys know or not. Remember the song Tiger Man? Look at that. Wow. Tiger. And there's a tiger. If you look real close, there's a tiger on the back. That's tiger, yeah. This, this, this right here, this right here was, was promoting his song, Tiger Man. And then that right there is the outfit that, 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 that this, this, uh, this lady made his outfit. And, and when, when he, when he did tag, tag when he, when Tiger Man come out, when, when he, when the, one of the, this right here is one, one of the, one of the suits that he performed in. The Tiger Man. Now, I, I know a little bit about it. As a matter of fact, I know just about everything about it. Now, granted, uh, you know some of those postcards and stuff—they're worth around a few dollars a piece yeah, on, I, I, on eBay. They, they ain't worth much. But 
it was five bucks for the entire little bag, and I decided, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up for the old man. He'd, he'd probably like it. But do you like it? I like it. Yeah, I, it, it, you know, they're 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 gonna. He go did have it. pictures. Yeah, they did have some pictures, but they only like ten dollars for it, and I was like, eh. Uh, well, pictures. And I looked at the photos; they weren't that great. No, they weren't that great. Photos. But you know, they, they don't mean much to anybody else except to an Elvis fan, which like like me. So you know. So it, real, so Joe, uh, Joey's like, for five bucks, I'll buy it for him. It's a, uh, it, 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 you know, it's it's not. And Pops you know, goes, yeah, I probably would have picked yeah, that. Yeah, I picked you that. Uh, you know, it, it don't mean mean much to, any, to anybody. You know, they ain't Elvis fans, so I am. So they, they it means something to me. And then we went over to one more yard sale yeah. before we head home. Uh, well, we hit one more at the last, but there wasn't anything there. No, there was nothing. There was nothing at that last yard sale. <clears throat> but the one before before we went home, uh, we were searching in this bucket that, well, not bucket, it was like a tote. Yeah. Uh, it was a red tote, and they had a bunch of DVDs in there. And I picked out a DVD, Tom picked out a couple DVDs, and, uh, you know, I was looking around. I didn't... They had a lot of stuff, but it's just like a lot of stuff. Just, uh, they even had a bop it there. You seen yeah. the bop it? I was thinking about buying that, but no, like, I didn't know if it worked or not. Yeah, I was like, oh yeah, yeah I remember that. Yeah, okay, yeah I, I, because I, I, I looked at, hey, that's a bop it over there. Yeah. Uh, I decided to pick this up now. My dumbass probably already has this. I don't know, but anyway, I went ahead and picked it up again. I probably already have this. I don't know. I got, I got, I got to, I got to look in my closet here and see if I have it or not. But uh, I picked it up and. I only got it for a dollar, so even if I was out of a dollar, who cares? Uh, it's the two-disc widescreen edition of Clerks 2, and it says that it has six hours of bonus features uh, with uh, with uh, that hot-ass, uh, what is it, Roshio Dawson? Yeah. She's hot. She is. But anyway, uh, she, she's hot in this movie, too. But uh, this is in a uh, this is in a blockbuster case, <laughs> blockbuster, <see>? blockbuster. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, and um, uh, both discs are there. It's in really good condition. Uh, even if uh, even if uh, the one I have is kind of shitty, this might be a better copy. I don't know. Yeah. So uh, at the end of the day, uh, and uh, clerks to uh, the clerks movies are are fucking hilarious. But uh, so I picked that up for a buck. I, I probably already have it, but, uh, oh well. <laughs> well, it was a dollar. It was a dollar. It was a dollar. It was a dollar. <coughs> oh, and it's worth, it, it, it's worth four dollars on it. Four bucks. So. What'd you get? Well, I found a couple of DVDs there. This DVD you've been looking for for a while. Yeah, I've been looking for, because I, I, I remember seeing it on, uh, on TV and stuff. I was like, yeah, that's a pretty fucking funny movie. Joanna Man. Joanna Man. Yeah. So I was like. I've been looking for it. I was like, you know what? Actually, I think you found that at Peddler's Mall one day, and you're like, I'm going to buy it. Yeah, and, they, disc, and the disc, disc was... Well, the disc is in this one. Yeah, the disc is in this one. Yeah, and it's actually in pretty good shape. Damn, that's like flawless. Yeah, it's like brand spanking new. So, by the way, Vivica A. Fox is fucking hot. Vivica A. Oh, uh, she's fucking hot. Yes. And this is a pretty funny movie. Yeah. And you remember... Uh, you remember him? He played. He played in uh, Life. Yeah, he played in Life. Yeah. Yeah. He he. It was funny. I remember the way the movie goes. He he got suspended from the NBA, so he dressed up like a woman to play in the WNBA. Yeah. Yeah. This movie's fucking hilarious. Yeah. So I had to pick it up. So I was like, uh, that's automatic pickup. So. And that DVD's worth six dollars. Yes. Yeah. Wow, I paid a dollar. Yeah. Paid a dollar. And probably the pickup of, of, of the day. The pickup of the day. Brand new. Even though it has a $2 price tag, which I didn't pay. No, he didn't pay $2 for it. Brand spanking new. Brand new. Never opened. Still sealed. Sealed. Yeah. Cops. 20th anniversary edition. Saturdays, 8, 7 central on Fox. No, they're not. <laughs> it says there. Yeah. Not anymore. Not anymore. Cops. 20th anniversary edition. This I enjoy cops. Yeah, cops was fantastic. Cops is still fantastic. Yeah, I uh, still watch it. And, uh, and this is brand spanking new. Still sealed. And it has nudity. It says right there, warning on yeah. on, on the side bowl. Oh, warning! Yeah, that yeah, could right, right 
Nudity, right. baby. Contains nudity, adult language, and <laughs> mature subject matter. That's right. Viewer's discretion is advised. Oh, it ain't gonna be advised for me. I'm watching. What this has is it has a television special on it. It has a it has the original pilot episode, yeah. uh, Las Vegas Heat episode, uh, yeah. parodies and tributes, famous fan favorites, uh, sizzling scenes of the first ten seasons. Um, and the second seasons. Story of Cops. There's a lot of stuff on this yeah. as as bonus. I, I think this is a two disc. Yeah, two disc set. Yeah, it's two disc set. Uh, and uh, this is still brand new yeah, seal. Brand new seal. And and I did not pay two dollars. Yeah, it says two dollars on it, but I only when, paid a dollar. Yeah, he only paid a dollar because he got it out of that box. And she goes, uh, dollar. I go. It says it says two dollars. She goes, that's all right. And Tommy, um. Do, do you know? Do you know how much that DVD is worth? No, I just picked it up randomly. Uh, he picked it up randomly, and honestly, guys, even if you find this used, pick it up because it's worth like yeah. fifteen bucks. But b yeah. with with it being brand new, thirty five dollars. Yeah, this is thirty five dollars. Uh, in case you guys don't understand, Tommy is holding a thirty five dollar movie that he bought at a yard sale for a dollar. That he bought at a yard sale for a dollar. Yeah, hell of a deal. It was a steal. I feel there's some other shit in here. Yeah, there, there, there's probably some inserts in there. Yeah, so, too. I was, and I like cops. I like the movie. I like the uh -huh. show cops. Are you going to open it or are you going to sell it? Oh, fuck no, I'm opening it. I'm going to watch it. You're going to open it up? You're going to break the value of it, Tommy. You're going to break the well, value of it. What you need to do is keep, keep that right there. If these keep motherfuckers want to go buy it yourself, like <laughs> I did. Go buy it yourself for a dollar. What you need to do is keep that safe. Maybe the value will go up. Yeah, fuck that. I'm opening it. It's, it's a DVD. I'm watching it. It's no a doubt. DVD I want to watch. All right. But that's everything we got at the yard sales. A lot Come of on, stuff. Come on, Joe. I know you would open it. I mean, I, I have a few sealed things myself. but uh, I'm sorry. Some DVDs I want to watch. But come on, come on, you would want to watch that. I got it. I, I got a few sealed things, too. Uh, see, the only one sealed I got is Chris Benoit, because that's worth a lot more. Yeah, and you pay, what, $3 for it? Yeah. But nonetheless. But this, I got that for automatic watch. We went yard sailing, and it was a success. It, it was successful. It's probably the biggest haul we had for a while. Dollar items, 50 cent items, even 25, 25 cent. cent items. I'll be guys. honest, this is probably the biggest haul we have so far. Yeah, as 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 far as as far as everything we bought and how cheap it value was. wise, this is probably like the biggest haul we had uh, on, so far. If we would have bought all this on on online with eBay and price charting of uh, this year, it's probably the biggest. eBay and price charting has everything for two hundred and twenty nine dollars. Yeah. Uh. We didn't pay two hundred twenty nine fucking dollars. No, we didn't. And I would never pay two hundred twenty nine. I wouldn't either. I'd be, I'd, I'd be walking out. That's for all the shit I got. Huh? We only spent yard selling twenty eight dollars. Twenty eight bucks. Uh, you know, pops paid eh, six bucks. You paid. Uh, let's see, dollar five. Uh, about twenty yeah. or so. For you, well, no, actually, hold on here. That was five. Mm -hmm. These were a dollar. Those were fifty cents. Twenty-five, 25 cents. cents. So that's a dollar. A dollar. Two. Dollar. Three, four, five, six. So you only spent like sixteen bucks. Yeah, sixteen dollars. And I only spent four, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, around 11 bucks. Yeah, I spent more than anybody. Yeah, you spent more than anybody. And then, on, honestly, I'm going to flip this and make my money back on everything I bought. So, that was a hell of a deal. So, pretty much everything I got was for free. Yeah, but you, made, you, but free. you got the biggest haul in cops, which, which, which maybe if you just keep it and not break the seal, and they go, uh, and they yeah, go yeah, with I'm the price. Breaking. Well, oh, hell, he's, he's breaking 50, the seal. He's going to break on, the 15 seal. 15 bucks is still not that bad of a He's price. breaking the seal. Hold on. But, but we only spent twenty-eight dollars. That's well, a total on. savings of two hundred and one dollars. Yeah, that's savings. We that saved $200 over two hundred and one dollars. We you know who appreciate those deals. Who's that? TNQ Ponder. The deal maker. The deal maker. The Tennessee native. The Ryan Tennille fan. Ryan Tennille. <laughs> but we hope that you guys enjoy this little yard sale pickup. 
Uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share it over social media. Like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash wrestling rampage2. You can follow us on, uh, you can like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash wrestling rampage2. You can also you can add us on either Facebook. Way. You can also add us on Facebook, uh, as well as you can follow us on Twitter at Russell Rampage. You can also follow me and Tommy on Instagram. Right? Yeah. You and follow also, me and Joe on Instagram. And you can also hit that subscribe button for more great videos coming to you guys because we're that cream that rises to the top. Cream of the crust. And nobody, nobody does it better, baby.